effective way of killing off coronavirus is being tested at an airfield in Flintshire. A company that repairs planes is using ultraviolet light to kill germs on board and says the system could be used almost anywhere. Matthew Richards reports. This is called Far UV, and while it looks beautiful, it's deadly to viruses like the one which causes COVID-19. But while ultraviolet light has been used as a disinfectant for generations, many of its forms are harmful to humans. This version operates at a frequency which doesn't penetrate the skin. It's not being tested in a lab or hospital though, but on a swanky private jet at this Flincher airfield. AeroCare Aviation has adapted the technology to create mobile cleaning lamps to quickly and safely spruce up the cabin. Well, so far, this technology is being used in the aviation industry, both here on private jets and also perhaps more widely in the commercial aviation sector. That's an area that's been deeply affected by the coronavirus crisis. But it also has much broader applications that we could start to see in everyday life. The company hopes airlines will be among the first to use the technology to significantly increase the speed at which aircraft can be cleaned and prepared for takeoff and reassure concerned travellers. But it's also developed booths like this which can be adapted and used almost anywhere. We're talking to the likes of uh, Gatwick Airport for example um, and we're trying to push hard on other major government institutions. Um, but obviously once you've reached those and you start to produce in the kind of numbers that we're anticipating, the pricing will come down. And uh, one day what we'd like to see is this in, in every shop, uh, potentially even in every home, um, every car, certainly every transport system. AeroCare employs around 50 people, but is hoping the demand for its far UV products will enable it to expand and perhaps bolster the local aviation industry, including its neighbour Airbus, which is cutting 1,400 jobs. This project was funded through uh, Innovate UK, which is a government scheme where you can apply for funding to run trials like this. And we were lucky enough to be granted the funding. So um, that happened very, very quickly. Um, and here we are testing it and waiting for the results. Hopefully we will be able to bring potentially some manufacturing to Wales at some stage to keep engineering in Wales, especially with the, the worry over Airbus. As the world searches for a way to conquer coronavirus, AeroCare hopes its lightning in a bottle will play a big part in keeping it at bay.